There must be loads of inflation to come. Goldman Sachs has stated on Monday that gold, $2,500, is achievable this year. Now, this is very interesting because when Goldman Sachs says gives a price target for something, a lot of people see that as a bit of a contrarian indicator. That means the price is going to go down. And uh, I've actually made the, in a previous episode of this, I've said gold $2,500. That was the same number. Uh, so maybe I don't feel quite so sure of it. What would you say, John? What, am I, uh, is, gold, are, is Boaz and Goldman Sachs correct or are, are we both wrong? It's interesting you say that because uh, Goldman historically has been a bullish house when it comes to risk assets generally. And look, it's understandable. They originate a lot of the stuff and they, yeah. it, they earn huge fees by originating and distributing a lot of this stuff. And so you can see the bias in, in the business model. That said, to be fair, I mean, sophisticated investors know that and they know to discount Goldman's perennial bullishness on risk assets. But I'll say this, that has been concentrated largely in the equity market. There's been the occasional call that Goldman has made when it comes to proper macro interest rates, currencies, commodities. A lot of those calls are right. I think they're more 50-50 in that area. So leave the equity market aside. If you're looking at anything else, actually, there might be something to it. And I would give it a fair hearing. And I actually have quite high regard. And, and indeed, I'm a former colleague uh, and acquaintance uh, or current acquaintance, I should say, of multiple current Goldman strategists slash economists. And so, you know, I have, don't get me wrong. I have no privileged information here. That's not what that relationships, what those relationships are about. But it's more of a, an insight into character. And these are hardworking, smart, and you know, honest people. Who now, don't get me wrong. You got to push the envelope when you work in that sort of role, right? Occasionally, be a bit provocative and whatnot. I've been yeah. in that sort of role my in much of my life. But don't just discount that. Whereas the whereas Goldman's equity uh, department does have this reputation for being just perennially bullish no matter what. And so I wouldn't, I, I wouldn't, I, 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 I wouldn't take that at face value necessarily. 